Yo, 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 what is up, chat? Apologies for the late start, but the first ten is still definitely happening. Rikudo versus Geza, man. Best players in the EU will be battling it out today, so look forward to the hype matches. Naturally, it's your host E back at it again. Yesterday we done the NA tournament, so if you want to catch up with that, I'll send you the link in the chat and you can catch it after this stream. Yo, Honcho, Prophet, Holo Yang, what's good, what's good, what's good, man? How you guys doing? We've got Wolfman, Members Gang, we've got Q, Mod Gang, Hisoka, what's up? Retro, Kai, Tempo, Kage, man, I should be watching Manchester United match, but <laughs> I hate you, bro. Revenge, what's good, guys, what's good, man? Good to see you guys in the stream, man. But yeah, without further ado, man, let's get started, man. Let's get started. You guys are not here to see me make conversation. You're here to watch the best players in the EU battle it out. So currently, Rikido Itachi, as far as I know, has been on an undefeatable streak. He's beaten Rij. He's beaten Rikido Itachi. He's beaten Geza twice. He's beaten Yukino. Bro, he's beaten all the top players in the EU and he's beaten Playco as well, 10-8. This man is on an undefeated winning streak. Can anyone take him down and stop his momentum, man? It's not looking likely, bro. It's not looking likely. Yo boys, who you got your money on? Good question. I'm gonna do a poll in a minute, uh Rizo, so you guys can vote. But what's up man? This is gonna be insane. Top tier EU gameplay you're about to witness, bro. Yo, triple seven, what's up? You're gonna hurt you recently beat Shan, it was down nine six but he came back and won ten nine. What a boss. Bro, he's just Taking out all the top players in all regions, this man cannot be defeated. Crazy, bro. Flygon, what's up? Blade, what's up? So Rush, what's up? Welcome, welcome. This man cannot be defeated. No one's taken him out yet. Imagine constantly winning first to ten against all the top players, man. You're goaded, bro. This man making history. People were having a conversation. There's the man himself in the flesh. People were having a conversation on who's top in the game, top one world. And a lot of people were saying, what I found interesting is a lot of people were saying Playco, and a lot of people were saying Rikido Itachi, so people were saying that Playco has been the reigning champ for so long he deserves it. But I was thinking about it more like a boxing match, you know how a champion wins and then they've, they have their like defending champion battles and if they lose, the title goes to the opponent that won in it. So I was thinking about it kind of like that. If you're the reigning champ then get defeated, the title kind of goes to your opponent, but naturally a lot of top players have dedicated fans but um, a lot of people were saying that oh Rikido Tachi's only won once again in Playco he can't be top one world yet but then again in the same breath in the same breath guys um, he has an opportunity to uh, fight Playco before so for him to fight him the first time round and win is still pretty good but it will be interesting to see their eventual rematch how Playco adapts knowing that uh, Rikido Touch is capable of beating him so that match will be interesting stay tuned for that but yeah man just waiting for Geza to join now but while we wait for that I'm gonna do some promotion I'm gonna change the thumbnail of the video and do some a quick promotion run so those of you that are watching if you're enjoying it so far feel free to share the stream we can get try and get as many people to view this as possible if we can, if we can. But yeah, man. Who's gonna take him down, man? Who knows, bro? Yo, James, what's up, man? He said Dark Mask. People are saying Playco's better than Dark Mask, though, these days. Bro, I've really become a fan of your channel, for real. Hey, Star, I appreciate you. Why do you say um, uh, you've become a fan? Like, what are the reasons? Deji's boxing match, that's what's happening to everyone fighting Rikido. <laughs> you watched it as well, man, like. Yo. 
I feel like this time Gizza has the power level to handle Rico Dodge as well. I mean, he's been on a hyperbolic time chamber. He did say he's been training, so let's see if the trainings are paid off. It's rules, not no rules. Oh, what's the rules, a touchy? Because Gezza told me it's no rules. Uh, yeah, what's the rules, he touchy? If it's rules, then I'll change the channel. Yo, Angel Philly, what's up? Not the time chamber. Yeah, man. Man's been in it. He's not playing any games. E, can you try bringing a calm here? I can't try and bring him. If he's busy, he's busy, innit? I have no control on whether he's available to commentate or not but whenever he is free he can join in whenever he wants but if you would like to hear his commentary definitely catch him on this channel man Um, rules, no you can turn and she can get tomorrow dash card one awakening per match. Okay. And two year. Oh, two years band as well. Okay, let me retype that then. E, did you sleep after that tournament or not? Yeah, defo. 100. I think Gesser already knows. Wait, can someone write down the rules for me? So you see where Rika Del Taji said the rules, can someone write it out for me and then I'll pin the comment, appreciate it. Oh, Hashirama Mash. Tried to lock him down with the Hashirama Mash, didn't work. Switch air, GT doesn't connect, both players maintain the neutral, Rikido Tachi currently has the health lead. Nice walk dash, nice tilt, nice shuriken, steal his turn back, that chakra dash cancel to extend the guard pressure. Gezo's already on no subs, max damage opportunity for Rikido Tachi, nice infinite and in sub bait as well. Both players low on chakra, nice counter parry by Gezo here, tried to burn a sub there, did not work, Rikido Tachi can get out of this, tried to go for the counter parry, didn't work because Gezo did the switch combo, instant guard break. Wake up pressure, both players low on chakra, no subs, he's gonna get the first convert. Guard manipulation opportunity missed, could have converted there. We could have touched with the healthy health lead. Healthy, healthy, health lead. Yep. Ooh, nice air to Ooh, that was a smooth sequence by Rikido Itachi there. Bro, his defense is as strong as ever, man. This man did not get caught at all. Look at it, Nagato Mash for the win! Jail? Nope, neutral combo, dash switch mash, your guard's done, take this ultimate, wait, nope. Maximum damage, I'm not sure why he did a grab buffer there, but hey man, why not. And Itachi's still as dominant as ever bro, Itachi's still as dominant as ever man. My goodness. My goodness gracious. Oh, Angel, shout out to Angel, man like. Appreciate you, bro. If you want that mod status, let me know, man. <laughs> that tilt. Oh, backhand of Rasengan. No, extends it. Gets it slowly trying to make the comeback. Rikido Touch is keeping the subs already on one sub. He's gonna play Switch Jutsu keep out. Geza has no chakra. Oh, gets the strike back. Can he get the convert? Max damage convert with the guard break. Is he gonna extend an attack up pill? Interesting conversion. Okay, attack up pill. There we go. Kind of delayed his combo too much, which caused him to get caught by the Nagas of support. Rikido Tachi awakens, bro. This is his first and last awakening this match. He can both players can only awaken once per match. Max damage opportunity here for Rikido Tachi here. 
Nice pressure. Oh, nice tilt by Geza there. I barely saw it. Nice pick up there by Rikido Itachi. Nice pressure with the awakening action. Take that panda, bro. Summoning. Naruto mash. Nice counter. He's going to be able to block that because he de-awakened. Invincibility frames. Nice tilt. Try to get the counter off. He's on zombie mode and Geza manages to close it out. Rikido Itachi still has the advantage here, but Geza still has access to his awakening. If he can get his storm gauge maxed out and go for the team awakening, he has a good chance to make the comeback here. Nagato Mash, subs, he didn't want the jail bro. Nice, switch Jutsu off guard there to keep up the pressure. Rikido Itachi's health is slowly going down by the second. Nice counter parry bro. And juggle as well, nice avoiding the tilt. Rikido Itachi needs to get his chakra back up. Jail opportunity here. Oh, guard break into max damage. Hey, Geza making the comeback and he hasn't even used his awakening yet. Looks like the hyperbolic time chamber training is paying off in spades, man. Oh, Rikido Itachi said, relax, bro. I know you trained, but I've always been this strong, bro. <laughs> relax that power level real quick. Naruto Airlines, nope, Geza missed the flight, he did not want it, oh awakening opportunity for Geza, don't let him awaken, he's got the awakening, come back, come back time for Geza here, the awakening merchant, trying to mash him, trying to mash him, trying to apply pressure, oh gets caught by the switch combo mash bro, you need to be careful of that, guard break, whiffs it, still gets caught, Geza with a really good chance of getting the comeback, rockets, guard break opportunity here for Geza, yep that man is dead, Take this, Rasengan. Beautiful comeback by Geza there. Wonderfully played. Congratulations, man. That was good. 1 0 to Geza here. The goat back at it again, keeping the community fed. Let's go, a hey, jam. I appreciate you. Appreciate you, man. That man, yeah, that man was dead, bro. Very, very nice optimal clutch play by Geza there. I see he's been watching Playco fights, man. That was nasty, bro. Alright, uh, let me change the title then. Match two, Geza with the first point on the scoreboard. Will he continue that momentum, or is Rikido Tachi gonna adapt back? Can I ask you what the good dash card characters? Choji, Yamato. That's kind of it. That's kind of it, man. Nice mash here with Nagato. Nice juicy buffer to cover his approach. We love to see it, man. Let's go, let's go. Let's what? Let's go, let's go. You could have actually bringing out Madara already. He's not playing any games. He's not trying to let Geza put any points, any more points on the scoreboard. I'm not gonna lie. He said, "Nah, not today, sir." You could have touched you with the health lead. Nice switch dodge by Geza there, jumping to avoid the last Naruto mesh. Smart man. A nice counter though.
Nice tilt, gonna get the convert, trying to look for subs, drops the combo instead, should have went for the max damage. Nice hollow step infinite, doesn't get the strike back convert because he hit a wall. Nice switch jutsu, guard manipulation, nice spark dash, tried to do out the combo, didn't work, max damage opportunity here for Rikido. Look at the damage, nice counter and he gets wake up pressure after this as well, when Geza's on no subs. Almost got the tilt convert. Nice, just shut down that approach. That man dead. Summoning. Wait, what? Oh, armor break made him drop the combo. That was unlucky. That was just unlucky. But I think he still got this though. Nice counter read by Geza here. Yo, Geza about to make this clutch because armor break said Naji. Drop that combo real quick. Yep, looks like Geza's got this clutch. Oh, he got stun lock. Even though he dropped the combo, Hashirama has great stun lock potential, so that's why he didn't move. Nice counter. Great reactions by Rikido Itachi there. Nice infernal fireball. Nice mix up. Nice dodging the tilt. Nice counter parry by Geza. Last second as well. Oh, snap. Hey, that was clean. Another clean sequence by Geza, man. He's really just trying to claim that top 1 EU title back for all. Nice kunai ninja movement, burning the sub as well. Nice, taking Hashirama out of there. And Rukido Utaji closes it up one round apiece. Who's gonna put the point on the scoreboard next? Nice dodging there by Rukido Itachi. Nice charge chakra dash, doesn't connect though. Hard dash to win the dash clash. Nice instant guard break tech. Geza knew what he was up to, responded to it nicely. Nice guard break. Oh, max damage ultimate jutsu. Oh, last Naruto. You need to do it close range otherwise it will miss. Most players on no chakra. Who's gonna make the first move? Staring competition. Nice. One more well placed chakra dash. Burn that sub from Geza. Nice patience there by Rikido Itachi here. Nice switch juice to defense by Geza though. Nice. Oh, max damage opportunity here, and he's gonna you know he's gonna extend it. Optimal way of extending it. Jump chakra dashes as well, minimizing the chakra cost, maximizing the damage. Nice tilt. Smash that man. Unlucky, missed the guard break. Lost Naruto Mash just barely reached him. Ooh, that punish. Take this, Chakra Cannon. Shine. Boom. Yeah, he's applying that pressure with the Kunai bag. He's got a sub trap as well. Very smart approach there. And that's it. Damn. 2 0. 2-0! Two 2-0 -oh. Two -oh together! Guess is not playing no games, bro. That man has spent a good year in the hyperbolic time chamber, yo. Hey, yo, Geza, give me the address. Give me the address, sir. Give me the address. Bro, if you're returning to the game after quitting, don't think you're being a top E, you probably play it every day. Yeah, that's true. That team right there is really one of the one of the team circles. Uh, which team Q? Geza plans slowly rejoicing to see Geza's top 1. Even if Geza wins this, he still can't claim the top 1 EU title because it's rules. So currently, 
We should only touch these actually nerfed. Cause it's rules, it's not no rules. So the victory wouldn't mean the same. But it would still be a good a good victory overall and push him towards reclaiming that title man. It's not about I just find a girlfriend friend last week, I'm done. I'm done. You see how both players are using Last Naruto? Last Naruto is really the meta bro. I'd say Last Naruto, Sasuke, whether it's Rene Sasuke and Last Sasuke and Nagato are the core characters that make up the current meta. Nice counter parry. Nagato juggle as well. Trying to look for a sub. Ooh, that sub trap was amazing. Got the guard manipulation, but Rikido Tachi responded with a paper tag. Nice. Ooh, that sub trap, bro. Might have to rewind that one. I don't really know what went on, but that was a nasty sub trap. Gotta respect the Nagato support. Gets caught by the last Naruto Jutsu. Nice strike back conversion. Tilting out the combo. Ooh, tilt to escape the combo, then counter to get out of the guard pressure. Beautiful stuff. We love to see it, man. This is why I love seeing EU players play, man. Especially the ones that are the best in the region. It's, it's too good, man. It's too good. Try to get the strike back convert. Wasn't fast enough and it was too far away. So it wasn't his fault. Try to tilt out of the guard pressure, but gets a Slightly delayed his guard pressure, so he'd punish the tilt escape. Very, very nice. Nice micro, micro decision making there by Geza. Strike back opportunity here. Strike back conversion complete. Try to go for the guard manipulation. Responding with a chakra dash. Nice hard dash win. Try to bait, again. He's trying to bait the subs, but still keeping up the combo. Very nice. I'm glad he still got him in a combo. Not dropping it. Juggles. Nope. Naruto Airlines. Nagato Mesh trying to come into play. Ooh, nice guard bounce pressure there by Geza, keeping himself safe while still applying pressure. Beautiful, man. Check out my guard bounce pressure guide to learn more. Shameless plug, I know, but I gotta plug it when I can, guys. I gotta plug it when I can. Very close match. Both players have very similar amounts of help. Strike back opportunity here. Gets the convert. Both. Ooh, his guard's on ready. Needs to be careful. Nice punish. Go for the jail. No. Why did you let the Why did you let the guard pressure go, bro? That was so unoptimal. Oh my goodness gracious me! You're lucky you still won that, Geza. You really let that jail go, bro. You really let that jail go. Nice last turn to mash. Nice right back convert. Nice juggle. Nice tilt. Bro, two stock here for Geza. Two stock opportunity. Ooh, almost catches him with the tilt. That was very nice. Now go to a gel. Can he do the hollow step gel? Ooh, got the short hop in as well. But that was a nice escape by Rikido Tachi there. Hey, Sun Fox Films. What's good, E? Hey, what's good, bro? Appreciate the $2 donation, man. Glad to see that you've joined us for the stream. It's currently 2-0 together. And he's trying to make it 3-0. He's not trying to let Itachi put any points on the scoreboard, bro. This is crazy. Nice charge dash. Nice counter bait. Nice tool. Geza is still maintaining his health lead though. Not gonna sub here. Denies the uh, air to ground combo reset. Very nice. 
Gets a strike back, doesn't convert. Nice, nice mash read, bro. Yeah, I can't escape from this Hashirama mash. Take these clones real quick. We had way too long to punish him there. I felt a bit of fear coming from Itachi there. Nice kunai bag. Still applying the pressure. Nice counter to counter. Nice. Nice. One hit Jutsu buffer. Burning themselves. Yep, this is game. If he doesn't drop it, this is game. There we go, it's done. Why did he do that? Why did he do ultimate jutsu? This man tried style on Rikido Itachi, bro. Come on, man. Now's not the time for that. If he makes the comeback, I'm done. His French came out, man. His French came out. What can I say, bro? Man said, you know what? I've basically got you dead, but let me style on you cool, real quick. You need to know when to style, guys, man. Rikido Itachi is really trying to make this clutch, though. He said you styled on the wrong person. Doesn't have enough chakra. Ooh, nice counter read. Counter read to counter punish. He said I'll bait you with the awakening, then punish you when you counter. I feel like I feel like players find Nagato less annoying to um play against than Yugito, because Yugito is literally tilt spam. Yeah, there's rules, man. We should make a top one rules and top one no rules. I guess you could do that, yeah. Hey, love your E, by the way. Best commentator, in the North Hemisphere. <laughs> hey, that's a big compliment, bro. Appreciate you, my guy. Bro try to be like Sabuto, huh? Yugito is more cancer than Nagato. Now Nagato has but has button locks, he has that awakening, the damage that he has in his combos, the infinite, the stun that he gets off his shuriken. I feel like people find Yugito more annoying to deal with though. But overall, Nagato is better. But I feel like, on the whole, you can create more cancer teams with Yugito than Nagato. Literally because of her tilt, her free tilt defense and her mash. But it's mainly because of that tilt, because both characters have good mash. I'm not gonna lie, E is more fun to watch than NA. Why do you say that? Can't really make top rules if they vary from player to player. Yeah, Philly, you're spitting the facts, you're actually right. E, do you think Chissy was a good counter to puppets? Alright, I need to do this puppet guide, innit? Because. Yes, Chissy is a wonderful. So, in fighting game, there's a term called uh, counter pick. So certain characters counter others. With puppets, Shisui, Shisui, Sarada, and people like Lost Naruto are perfect counters to puppets. Looks like I need to face more uh, puppet players and, and show you how you would use Shisui to counter them. Ugh, that max damage combo though? I mean, you don't need Dunzo to, to destroy puppets. He could have picked Sarada, he could have picked Shisui. He was using Last Naruto. There's a lot of characters that literally shut down puppets. But Bill was playing really well with puppets, so that Dunzo pick, I don't think that Dunzo pick would have been enough. Yeah, I'll play you with puppets. Say no more, bro. I think I've already played your puppets, though. Oh, Hashirama Infinite. 
one yesterday, Dark Mask. Nice grab finish. Boom. Rasa shutdowns puppets do. Yeah, you're right, Barushiki, but he only shuts down puppets a lot um, close range. So you have to get in first, then you can use Rasa to shut them down. So he's not as useful as someone like um, Shisui or Sarada that can shut down puppets at all ranges. Boom, backhand Rasengan. No, oh, never mind. He jumped out of it. Yeah, I'm talking about for video E. Oh, okay. Last Naruto can still... Um, Last Naruto can still um, uh, count as a counter pick towards puppets. And I wouldn't say Mask uh, cooked him because um, it was close. I think it was 5-4. So that to me that doesn't count as someone getting cooked. Plus, um, Bill did two stock mask in one of the matches, so therefore not counting that as mask cooking him. That's for sure. But both players still played really well, regardless. Though, if it was five zero to mask, then I would say yeah, okay, mask cooked him. But five four isn't 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 someone getting cooked. Bro, man denied that to escape with the shuriken nicely. Hashirama mash. Hashirama mash again. Reset him to get mashed. The power of Hashirama, guys. Uh, he delayed it too much, so he was able to wake up counter. He should have done... He should have switched out of the combo quicker. Then he wouldn't have got countered. Nice chakra dash uh, cancelling there to avoid the punish. Nice switch back to avoid the punish again. Oh, uh, extended it incorrectly. Ended the guard pressure a bit too early there. Ruto looking for that sub. Make that man fly. Yeah, he was looking for that sub. Didn't get it though. Just dropped the combo for free. Dropped the combo for free again. Hashirama mash. Dropped the combo for free again. What's going on, Ruto Itachi? You're not playing as optimal as you usually do. Nice. Don't drop it this time. Nice one. Nice counter to counter. Switch to uh, cancel out the recovery frame so he could apply pressure before he recovered. Beautiful stuff. Oh, Geza gonna try to go for the awakening. Yep, he's gonna try. He's either trying to go for awakening or bait him into something. Ooh, that guard break. Loop it. Loop it until that man's dead. It's still your turn back. End it. Let's go. Rikuro Itachi putting up point on the scoreboard. 3-1 together. You gotta play against Boroshiki. He crazy. I can't. I'm not on PC. And I don't think Boroshiki plays on console. Plus, I believe he's NA as well. So... My my playstyle will be deleted. Bro was using two poppers on the same team. It takes the next level of skill to do that and still win. I agree. Mars did look better consistently to me. Yeah, that's fair. But I feel like naturally people have against a uh, bias against puppets anyway. So a lot of people are not going to be rooting for Bill regardless. Anyways, so. Yo, Joyce, what's up? Welcome. We need the Bill vs Unico for top one puppet. Yeah, that'd be that'd be sick. Rikudo got nerfed. Oh, he hasn't gone out all out yet. Rikudo is nerfed in 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 rules though, because he can't use Kaguya. So he is technically nerfed. But yeah, I don't think he's playing all out just yet. R.I.P. Clean Sheet. Nah, legit though. Yo, Joker, what's up, man? How you doing? Bit bro, she said, console? <laughs> he said, oh no. That thing? 
But yeah, no, I would love to play um, Boroshik and a lot of other PC players, but I don't blame them for not wanting to play on console when they've had the luscious experience of playing on PC. I don't blame them one bit. Like, that's me playing on PS5 and, and going back and playing on PS4. I can't do it, bro. PS4 is just such a better experience. Well, no, sorry, not PS4. PS5 is such a better experience. Input delay is reduced, so a less lag when you're playing, basically. And everything loads faster as well, and there's less frame drop, so the game's more consistent. Bro, why would I want to go back to PS4? Max damage opportunity here for Rikido Itachi. Looks like he's readapting. Look at his health lead. Geza brought out Dunzo. Geza doesn't really actually play Dunzo, so I'm surprised he brought him out. Guess he was feeling the pressure after losing that set, or that match, I should say. Strike back opportunity here. Connects it. Nice dodge of the ultimate. Last minute return mash. Dodged out of it. Firms all that damage. Nice strike back convert. Geza juggle as well with Madara. That's what we like to see. Nice shuriken to get that convert. Nice shuriken again. Backhand Rasengan. Ooh, that was optimal. <laughs> Riki Itachi's back, guys. That was optimal, man. That was sexy. I agree with you, Harris. That was sexy. That man said, I want you dead, and I want you dead now, bro. Bro, that's tracking on the ultimate? <clears throat> Perfect chakra dash cancel to extend the guard pressure. Nice switch back to avoid the punish on the jutsu. Now he's going to pressure him. He needs to charge his chakra, but Geza's on red guard. He can easily get a two stock here. Nice juggle. Oh, switches to extend the juggle. Nice guard break. Max damage opportunity here. Let's go. Show him how it's done, Itachi. Show him how it's done, bro. Now he's going to play keep out. No subs, no chakra. He's going to maintain the neutral as long as possible. Geza needs to push him though. He has the chakra advantage. Nice guard break. He said, yo, take this damage real quick. I think that man dead. Yep. He thought she said, I can kill you too, you know. Can Geza make the clutch here? Nice ninja move to avoid the chakra dash. Nice counter parry. Nice bait on the mash. Max damage for Geza here. Nice keep out. Nice punish. Yo, Geza might actually make the clutch. Try to switch to avoid the chakra dash punish, but couldn't get it. Nuruto Airlines only taking him on one flight today. Try to counter. Yo, awakening opportunity here for Geza here. Awakening opportunity here for Geza. Oh, got the max damage and he's gonna get. Nope, the awakening denied. Nope, he got it. Oh, Geza could make the clutch. Guess I couldn't make the clutch. Nice too. Yo, it's a long day for you, Tachi. Oh, it's a long day for you. He's got Danzo as well. It's a long day for you, bro. It's a long day. I think... Yo, ugh, that That man Geza wants him dead. Oh, almost got the optimal punish. Oh, damn. That's a highlight right there. That is a highlight right there. Jeez Louise. You see there near the end, Itachi tried to go for the optimal kill punish by getting the juggle then going straight into Pain's air jutsu but he didn't do it fast enough so he didn't connect so Geza dropped out the combo and that allowed Geza to win the match by punishing Itachi for going for the grab. Beautiful stuff man. How were you able to get a PS5? I need one. Um, I went on like one of those sites here where they tell you 
um, when a PS5 is available and they will give you the site, I can send you the link. Uh, let me know your Discord and I'll send you the link. But basically, they'll tell you when a PS5 is available. You just check it like every hour or so, and they'll tell you what site to go to you in like your area and all of that. Basically, so that's how that's how I got it. Together the awakening master man. As I always say, don't let that man get awakened, bro. It's bad for your health. Literally. And when it put it from Tesco. You added me this full calm out accepts after this match. No problem at all, man. Nice Kunai Ninja movement. Not Danza Mesh coming in clutch. Ooh, barely dodged the um Hashirama Mesh. Nice guard break. Can't go for max damage in the opportunity in the air because he has low chakra. Nice counter at the last second. Nice choke. Nice dodge, bro. Nice guard break. Switch combo into guard break. Very hard to dodge. Nice patience with the mashy patchy. Nice hard dash. Nice tilt. Because the subs are coming back. Subbed way too early. Almost got the guard manipulation opportunity to convert. Yeah, he kind of just air dashed for no reason there. He air dashed for him to get punished. If I was he touched, I would have extended that, bro. I'm not gonna lie. Hmm, this is kind of countering a bit too much there. Nice switch air jutsu, but that directional sub was that Naji. Take this, come no no. Yeah, it's legit a different game on PS5, 100% agree. The game's more stable, it runs smoother, less miss, less miss inputs, uh, smaller um, input delay. It's literally a different game, no joke. Like you're just you're just playing closer to offline when you play someone. Um, when you play someone that's using PS5 and you're on PS5 as well. But you still reap those benefits if you're playing on PS5. But I need to make a video about it, man. Explaining like all the benefits in detail. Yo, Rico Truck is gonna go for the two stop. Oh, he's already a one round up. Nice sub bait. Lovely stuff. Tried to catch him with the Madara Mash, did not work. Tried to convert off the attack. Ooh, that Chakra Dash cancel with Spark Dash was disgusting. Delaying the combo to catch a tilt and he caught it, bro. Nice one by Geza. E team suggestions for Hanzo. Last Naruto, Hanzo and Mifune is a good team. Or Esprit Madara, um, Mifune and Hanzo is a really good team. Or Darui, Last Naruto and Hanzo is also another really good team. Or Pain, Darui. 
and uh, Hansa is a really good team. So I just gave you, I don't know, five suggestions. So yeah, man, take your pick. So if someone is on PS5, plays with someone on PS4, they have an advantage. Yeah, the PS5 person has an advantage. So think about it as someone playing in blue bar and someone playing in yellow bar. The person in blue bar has advantage, basically. Geza could still come back though, all he needs to do is land that one shot. Nice counter by Rikido Tachi going for the switch due to the fence. That tracking on that ultimate is no joke, that reach on the tilt though. Nice counter bait, beautiful counter bait, baited it twice. Trying to get as max damage as possible here, tried to switch to Danzo to get for the one shot but his awakening ran out. Now instant guard break into optimal damage by Rikido Itachi here. Got as much damage as he could before Geza could sub out that combo. Geza's gonna have to play perfect if he wants to come back. Nice pull cancel into counter. Cancelling the recovery frames with the pull. Allowing him to, to counter as soon as he landed on the floor. Damn, that tilt check by Rikido Itachi. 4-2 man. E, who do you think is better, Sabito or Geza? Please be serious, Geza. As far as I know, Sabito hasn't... Oh no, he did win against Rage once actually. I don't know if he beats top players consistently, but I know Geza does, so... Definitely Geza, man. Yeah, there's no problem being confident in yourself, Madara. As long as you're not toxic, it's all good, man. Why is there no Danzo? Uh, both players didn't think he was worth banning. I feel like you know the answer to that question, Zui. He can make the comeback. He's probably gonna save his awakening for the next round. Unlucky. Unlucky man. Hey bro Shiki with the 499 donation. I see you guys trying to get another donation train going. Hey, appreciate it, bro. Thank you so much for the financial support, my guy. 
More shuriken keep out with pain. Pain is one of the characters with one of the best shurikens in the game, along with Madara. Uh, Yugito as well, Momoshiki. Great for applying pressure in the neutral. Gez is just currently waiting here. I'm not sure what he's waiting for though. Tried to go for the instant guard break, gets checked by Rikido Itachi. Nice counter. Nice teleport. Nice extension, gets countered though. With an airtight. Bro, that grab teleported. What was that? That grab legit teleported. Hey, stop hacking, bro. Apparently, bro player said, you know what? Let's do a troll spin real quick. Wait, what happened? He sub banked accidentally. Uh, let me rewatch it. Hold on. Oh yeah, no, he did sub bank. When the grab teleported, he sub banks. You can restart. You can restart the fight with the same health, same item. Oh wait, I think they restarted the subs. Yeah, I think they restarted the subs. Yeah, I don't agree with that, uh, Saturn, bro. But yeah, I'm pretty sure Rikido Itachi didn't meet didn't mean to sub bank. Yeah, perfect chakra dash cancel by uh Geza there. Yeah, he, he accidentally did it, yeah, yeah. Um, I don't think Rikido Itachi did sub bank. No, he did. There's multiple ways to sub bank. The way he did it, he actually did it. But he just did it accidentally, not on purpose. This makes me want to play Naruto after the stream, damn. Nice switch dodge, couldn't dodge the second tilt though. Tried to bait a sub there with the shuriken after strike back, didn't work. Nice guard manipulation. And Rikido Itachi takes it man. 4-3 man, 4-3. Yes, yeah, four three currently, man. Four three together, man.
We got 141 viewers. Let's get it, man. Appreciate you guys coming through. We've only got 45 likes. Can we can we get up to like 100, guys? Come on. I know we can do it. This is the first thing is more than 10 gameplay wise. Then it was more than 10 chat wise because at least it was English. Okay, now I get you. Can I agree with you on that? I feel like my favorite fight from the NA tournament was uh, Senji vs Mask and then Bill vs Mask as well because I enjoy both of all of their playstyles. Mask is very aggressive, Senji is very aggressive as well and adapts well at high speed and Bill because he's a top tier puppet player that plays two man puppet teams which, is, which I find to be sick. So yeah, those were probably my favorite matches from the tournament. Yeah, Chakradash cancel though. Respecting Rikido Itachi. Damn, that reset, that free reset from the Kunai bag, unlucky. Rikido Itachi is trying to tie it up, man. Oh, nice convert off the tilt, nice juggle as well. Going for that max damage. Caught last Naruto as well. Oh, nice, getting out of the combo with the Shuriken, bro. Nice counter, wake up pressure, what are we doing, Nagato mash? Damn, caught him tilting. Preemptive counters man, can't be doing that. Nice grab, you remind me of me. Switch Jutsu defense. Nice, look at the respect and the patience from Mikido Itachi here. Tried to get out of the jail but couldn't do it. Yeah, Shuriken's gonna shut down that combo and he gets strike back. Drops the combo though. Shouldn't have gone for one hit juice to buffer. Should have just went for the normal combo convert. Yeah, gotta respect that Nagato Jutsu, bro. Sorry. Nice guard break. Nice extension. I'm not sure why he chose to drop it there. I don't get that one. Activating the Hashirama stun lock. Yeah, he shouldn't have dropped that man. I don't know what why he did that. That made no sense to me. Caught him on landing frames. Oh switch too late, didn't get the strike back. Awakening opportunity here for Rikido Itachi. He's not going to use it because there's only 10 seconds left on the clock. I'm going to save it for the next round. Trying to play keep out. Time waste. Yep, going for the time waste switch due to defense. 4, 3, 2, 1. And that's it, man. There's not much Geza could have done in that situation. Maybe I've had more Chakra for sure. Nice one hit juicy buffer. Damn guard manipulation into chip damage bro. Yeah, are you excited for any games coming out this year? Good question. Uh probably definitely God of War. Uh you know, obviously Storm 5 whenever it gets confirmed. Um what other games are coming out? 
I was thinking of getting Roller Dome, but I'm not sure in it. But I'll probably pick it up at some point. What else? There's some other games, I just can't remember them right now. What about you, Aboroshiki? Hey, do you smoke gas? No, I do not, man. That is bad for your health. Should again. We could have really trying to try tie this up right now. E, who you got? I mean, who am I rooting for? Where am I from? The UK, man. E, Pleco wants revenge versus we could have touched you. You got to schedule this. I'll ask we could have touch you if he's up for it. But welcome to the don't let get awaken E. Facts, man. CE, is Shifu worth it, bro? Q, I know you like fighting games. Bro, uh, Shifu is one of the games where it's so satisfying to people beat people up. So if you can get it like on sale, or if you don't mind playing the price that it is now, like it's so worth it, bro. Like, especially on PS5, bro. Like, bro, it's so satisfying. I've never had so much satisfaction out of beating the computer up and bosses up on the game before like my goodness bro but don't don't get it twisted though that game is hard especially when you're learning it but once you master it bro oh my days you feel like such a boss oh my gosh so yeah definitely recommend it man plus it's been updated and st stuff has been added to it now as well bro definitely worth it and now it's 4-4 man Yo, you instead of doing first to tens and whatnot, what do you think about first to two stock? That would be kind of fun, not gonna lie. It would be, but I know a lot of players wouldn't want to do that. So that wouldn't happen. I mean, after he be Pleco, did he play any other top players? He's played Reach, Jao, Unico, Pleco, Gezar. We could already touch him. That's all the top players that he's played. And he played Shan. Pete Chat was saying he played Shan as well. A top player from Asia. So yeah. Yeah, I agree with Omar. Fights can be often inconsistent and quite momentum based. So two stock can really just happen when you're not really even doing too much. Like for example, you can win one round, then get triple awakening, then boom, two stock. Yeah, do you think there's someone that can beat Itachi hasn't played him yet? Like Flake, maybe? Nah, I wouldn't say Flake, but yeah, for sure. I mean, Playco can rematch him. I definitely think Playco can rematch him and beat him. Uh, from what I'm hearing from the community, Boroshiki can do that as well. Uh, I feel like Dark Marks has a good chance, especially because from what I've seen in the tournament, he knows how to play Kaguya. So those kind of players, for sure. But outside of that, no. You kind of need, you need, we need the upper e echelon of 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 Storm Four players to take Itachi out now. <laughs> that's 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 how far of the ranks he's uh, gone up, bro. Well, Sada and Nanashi consider top players, he f titled them as well, yeah, Sada and Nanashi are top players for sure. Yeah, Mars probably wouldn't play him due to cross-region delay, and I don't blame him, don't blame him. Uh, Reed is, start, is, is trying to start some set, some stuff, bro. I discovered his tech last stream, but Reed, what's up, man? Welcome.
If you could still, if you could see two players uh, on offline connection playing against her, who would it be? Mm, good question. Probably Django and Playco. That them at their max strength would be so entertaining to see. Yeah, Django and Playco. That's my one. What about you? Hmm, let's go. Rasengan, bro. Nice Chakra Dash cancel there by Geza Lightning Force. So, Itachi listen to close out this round. Nice counter. Wake up. Pressure. Oh, the Shuriken pressure. Guard manipulation. That tilt. Nice air tilt, man. Nice card manipulation. Nice card manipulation into convert. Rikidoki Tachi can get the two stock if he pushes gets us here, and that's exactly what he does. Max damage opportunity here. Yep, he can't equip attack up pill. He goes straight for the combo. Smart man. Uh, optimal again. Gets a managed to get a sub back. Yep, Hashirama mash. Oh, uh, he was mashing too much, so he couldn't get a juggle. Uh, misses the guard break. Gets punished. He could have closed it out if he didn't if he juggled with Hashirama instead of going for the air combo. Rasengan denied. He can ninja move out that guard pressure. Hashirama mash. Ooh, that delay bro. That was nice. Ooh, that dodge into mash, that was clean. Ooh, hey, that was a clean Oh my goodness. That was clean. Oh my gosh. That was just a clean sequence, bro. Clean sequence. I don't know why Rikido is top 3, he should be top 1 EU. I say currently he is, because he's literally um, played all the top EU um, players. And not only won, it's been convincing um, set wins. Mm. 
No, Rikido, I, Rikido, I swear Reach is better than Rikido. So I wouldn't put Rikido third. I'm pretty sure Reach is better than Rikido, uh, level 9. If this is their third fest, then who won the first two sets? Um, Rikido. Rikido won uh, the first set, I think, 10-5, then the second one, 10-6. I think that's what the score was. Watch, watch, if you don't believe Reed is better than uh, Rikido uh, level 9, watch their first attempts, bro. Reed has been winning recently. You must have the first attempt Reed versus Rikido level 9, rules and no rules, Rikido run elsewhere. Maybe I missed some then. Last time, last time I was watching, uh, Reed was winning. Currently the fight is pretty even though, both players on similar amounts of health. Looks like Minotaur is kind of working for Giza here. And just as I said that, Rikido Itachi gets the health lead. Jeez Louise man. Nice, not subbing there on the uh, Rasa confirm, beautiful stuff. Rikido Itachi can actually play, um, wait no he can't play health lead actually, Giza actually has the health lead currently. So he's got a push. Yep, he's got a push, man. Ugh, that guard break, and he's got it. He's got the health lead, now he can run away. Geza can't even catch him because he's got no chakra. Switch Jutsu, two seconds to survive, and he's got it. Uh, Geza was playing really good at the start, but Rikido Itachi started adapting, so Geza's adaptation rate is slowing down. When top players f fight, it's just a race on who can adapt first, and who can, can adapt consistently as well. Can you adapt to my ad adaptation after I adapted to your adaptation? And it's just a back and forth like that. Yo E, when are you getting some Storm 1 gameplay? Probably never. Nah, I will never do first to 10 from Storm 1 or Storm 2. Storm 1 and Storm 2 compared to Storm 4 is trash. So that's, ne that's never gonna happen.
someone has online and I think you can play online on PC but that's it. Yo, Huff, I'm doing good for a high there. Nah, I will never do any content Storm 1 related. That would be a waste of my time. Nice guard break. Kind of a waste since his guard was red, but hey, as long as whatever gets you to convert into max damage, boom. He's not dead yet, but this is going to do a lot of damage. Yo, Captain, your Storm do is literally a chess game. No, it's not, bro. When I mean, you can sub an ultimate in that and it's actually strong, then nah, gee. Who are some of the better EU new gens? Uh, Sabito, Zui, uh, Crown, Spades. I think Ahmed might be a new gen, but I'm not sure. Q. I don't know if Rosh is new gen, I'm not sure. Alright, Rikido Touch takes another point, but yeah. Optimal. Top three E versus top three NA. If we had no delay, he would win. I don't know. We've never seen anyone play in no delay before, so that's just a question mark. Six four to Itachi man. Let's go, let's get it. Do not enter rest mode, sir. That's not what we want. That is not what we want. We've only been streamed for an hour. Felt longer, man. So both players using Sage Hashirama. Trying to get that wood mash on their opponents. Pause. Gesa has the chakra advantage here, but gets caught out by Rikido Itachi's fast chakra dash. Nice convert, Naruto Airlines, we're only taking them on one flight today. We haven't got enough gas to do multiple flights. Sorry for the inconvenience. Nice dodge, doesn't dodge the second Naruto clone. Gets the strike back conversion. Hashirama Mash coming in clutch. Nice guard bounce pressure, keeping out the pressure with the shuriken buffer. Ooh, juggle in, reset into ground combo. The switch dodge as well and gets the convert. Max damage opportunity here for Geza. Trying to bait that sub. Ashirama Mash. Could have did a guard break there. But he didn't. Nice burning subs in a neutral. We love to see it. Almost got the convert but dropped it. Unlucky. Switch juicy defense coming out for Rikido Itachi. Nice guard break. Gets the strike back convert. Rikido Itachi's back subs are back though. Nice kunai ninja movement. Had to burn a sub there. Doesn't go for the awakening. Tries to bait him into an action but decides to go for an anime. Rockets. Playing it patient, unlucky, Hashirama Mash caught him, and gets a set up a sub trap as well, beautiful stuff man. 
take these rockets real quick, my guy. Take some wood for your travels as well. You're gonna need that. Gets to convert. Yep, that's done. Summoning Panda. Boom. Let's go, man. How come the top guys across the region don't run sets on PC? Didn't play find a way to improve the netcode and no PC. Not everyone that's a top player has a PC available. Yo, Dynast, what's up, man? It's currently 6 4 to um, uh, Rico. Damn, I'm too busy reading the chat. Not even too sure who just won that. Oh, what's that? I guess I guess it was a two stock. Yeah. Tilt finish as well, nasty man. I wish you made a new gen Tony E. Um, I'm still planning to do one with Harlem, but I, I just need to wait until he's available. But that is in, that's in the planning, man. Make a TVD random mate tournament. Nah, that's that's too much work, bro. Too much work. Alright Reach, I'll see you later man. Peace out man. GG's I stopped cause Oh Levi you going too? That you got me every time. <laughs> hey Toxy, good to see you in here, man like. That 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 um that reaction always comes out when players do something disgusting. Are these two playing in no delay? No, when you play online there's always some sort of delay. But they're playing the in the best possible connection on Storm 4, which is blue bar, so three bars. I cannot play right now, I am commentating. Nice guard manipulation into Master Naruto Mash. Nice Chakra Dash cancel into guard pressure. Ninja moves out the guard pressure, strike back conversion opportunity here, gets it. Nice guard manipulation again, yo, that Hashirama hitbox is no joke bro, he missed the conversion but got it because Hashirama's hitbox was so big, pause. Backhand, nope, neutral combo, extends it, trying to get that max damage here, nice ninja movement there, avoiding the punish, switch jutsu defense. Oh, okay, no problem Levi, but welcome, welcome. He did not get the spark dash. Nice sub bait there. Nice counter bait into punish, man. 
Yo, did not respect that ultimate at all. Backhand Rasengan? Nope. Naruto Airlines finish. Let's go. He said YouTube should ban Kage from my streams. I'm done. Nice convert of the shuriken. That was nice. Nice counter parry. Oh, Rico with the clutch. Oh, Optum punish once again, bro. They were using six pass Madara earlier, but they but they kinda traded him for Sage Hashirama and lost Naruto. Easier to be aggressive with Lost Naruto and Sage Hashirama on the team. Hashirama and Mesh still coming in clutch even though he dodged it. Guess it was the health lead here. Nice convert. Almost got sub trapped there. Nice two out of the guard pressure. Nice counter parry and nice patience as well. Making sure not to get countered twice. Boom, conversion opportunity. Teleported right to him. Why did that drop? Nice pick up again by um Rikido Itachi. Nice switch dodge as well. Nice. Nice. Yo, Sage members gang. What's up man? How you doing? It's currently 6-5. To Rikido Itachi. Yo, Bluster didn't waste no time. Drop that score real quick. Instant guard break opportunity here. Burning those subs, bro. Is he actually gonna tie it up? Nice. Hashirama mash. Narrowly missing the counter. Looks like Hitachi's gonna tie it up. Nice knowledge check. Nice counter. Nice counter, yo. You guys are right. So many counters. Kaguya's banned. He can't bring out Kaguya. Neji is also banned, so that's why you haven't seen him pick him. The rules are pinned at the top. Chair, chair tech, chair defense tech, let's go. Damn, and he did the one faux pas you shouldn't do. He let Gezo awaken, bro. Oh no. Oh, if he gets off for Hashirama Shuriken Jutsu, he can actually awaken. Or Pain Jutsu. One of the two. Yep. Come on, you can do it. Nice, there we go. See, I told you, as soon as he got off the Hashirama Shuriken Jutsu, he awakened, man. Uh, we got the reads in gameplay and in the commentary, bro. Okay, now it's Rikido Tachi's turn to make something happen. Nice counter. What are we doing? Absorption setup? Rockets? What are we doing? Are we waiting? Only got 15 seconds on the awakening clock. You gotta make something happen. You gotta make something happen, man. Oh, damn. The double counter. Unlucky. Yo, E, you set up the rules or did both agree to the rules? Both players agreed to the rules. I had no involvement in setting up the rules. Bro, the troll spin! I'm dead! <laughs> This man went for the mental damage, bro. Oh, I'm done. No way. The last two matches have been no rules. Nah. All matches have been with the rule set that's been pinned at the top. This man went for the mental damage. He said, you know what? I'm a guard break and troll spin you instead of killing you real quick. Oh, I'm done.
So Dan's the one shot is allowed here. If if it's not on the rules list, then it's not banned, and you can use it. A reminder, Rage quit in the last fight in the last first to ten. That didn't happen in the most recent one. In the last one. Oh sure, I'm a mash coming in clutch. Rikido is only good with OP characters. Uh, that's Cap. Watch my recent fight with him. This man was using Karen and playing really well. So yeah, that's Cap, man. But if you want to find out, play him yourself, man. Cucumber health lead, but health lead all the same, man. And Geza takes the first round. Bro, you serious? Banned me? Who banned you? Rikido is only good because I had my eyes closed, huh? Rikido, he touched you slowly making the clutch, I thought he was gonna awaken there. Oh, max damage opportunity here for Geza, is he gonna go for the ultimate juicy cancel? Yep, up some more. Boom, this man's health is gone, bro. I didn't ban him. I timed him out. Oh, 
Oh, okay, uh, Sin, I get you. Yo, Saint, long time no see. How you doing, man? Guess I've gotten some nice momentum. Facts, bro. I think, yeah, he's got this match in the bag, bro. This man Rico's grabbing on those subs. Damn. Had the counter read but couldn't read the second counter man. But that's match for Gezar. Seven six to Gezar. He's adapting back man. Yeah, both both players have really good defense. You got 67 likes on the stream. Dun, dun, dun. Let's go again, man. You probably on Twitter right now. Nah, I wasn't on Twitter. Here on my mash, max damage opportunity here. I was he gonna confirm the sub? One more convert. Oh, tried to get the guard manipulation, but got out of it with the chakra dash. Nicely done. Tries to catch him on landing frames off the strike back to now, but doesn't quite get it. Nice. No, he dropped the conversion. Okay, he still got it. Nurture Airlines? Nope. Switches back to Nagato. Nice follow step to get out of there. Full down combo. Yep, backhand or Sengan. Let's go. I've been good, Saint. How you been? Oh, I tried to switch to make himself safe, but couldn't quite get it. Trying to look for opportunity to use that Hashira match. Nice counter, bro. The bravery to counter while uh, the last Naruto Jutsu was still coming out. I'd love to see it, man. Did he just run back into that fire and get hit again? Damn, that's unlucky. He has to switch. Oh, he should have switched there to avoid the shuriken. Oh, 
Um, Saint, join my uh, Discord. If you haven't been getting notifications, either follow me on Twitter and hit all notifications on because I always tweet out events, or join the Discord because I always let my Discord know when I'm streaming or when there's an event going on. Or when there's a video, like the Discord gets um, pinged whenever there's an event on the channel, so yeah. Nice counter. Man, equip the attack up pool in the air, man. Like. Looks like Itachi's got this man. Yeah, he got it. That man dead. Rev cancel. That's a two stock. Bye bye. Bye bye. Wow, you are good. 7 7 E, do you get the Wendy's? Nah, Wendy's recently came to the UK, but I haven't tried it yet. Is there a way to display the score on the screen? If I was on PC, yeah, but on PS5, no. Don't forget to like the stream, guys. I appreciate you, Venom. Yukido is only good with OP characters. Sat and relax with the tracks. Trash talk, my guy. It's getting a bit too much, man. Yo, Zui, what's up? Ugh, that counter bait, man. That was nice. Nagato Joe? I'll have to add you to a list because I've got a first to ten list currently. I still need to do Malice vs. iPal. So. Really good last time I had it. I'm have to check it out, but I have no idea what to get at Wendy's though, because I've never been. Damn, we gotta touch you with the healthy, 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 healthy to leave. He was like, nah, I'm not trying to let Gazo awaken. I will do an air dash with no chakra if I have to. Nice awakening bait there by Gazo. Oh, if he wasn't hit, he could have got the strike back conversion. Tried to read the chakra dash with the um, hash rubber mash, didn't quite get it though. Naruto Airlines completely missed there. 
Nice counter read, bro. Beautiful. Probably about like a year or two Q depending if you um you know when you're fully charged and you still charge it that will kill off the batteries as long as you're not doing that it can definitely last like uh two years yeah so like Saturn said it depends on battery battery health but it degrades naturally over, over time We could do a touch trying to get a two stock here. Awakening opportunity. Oh, I thought he was going to do a switch jutsu with Nagato and then go for awakening. Look at this defense. Uh, he's got it. Yeah, it's a long day. He's got Madara on his team as well. It's a long day. Man did a troll spin. He said, Geza, I can troll spin too. It's a long day. Uh, I'm surprised he got countered there. I'm surprised he didn't do the awakening action sooner. Damn, got caught on landing frames. Damn, that sub trap as well. Nice counter. I'm surprised if they counter parry. Damn. Yep, max damage. Oh, it's a long day, bro. Why did he do a grab there? I'm surprised he's doing no ultimate. I wonder why he didn't do an ultimate. I'm not sure. But it looks like the decision is working out for him, though. Reduce Gezzers to no, sub, no subs all over again. Even if Gezzer awakens now, he's still got this. Yo, that's Shuriken Jutsu. Yep, backhand Rasengan finish. Extends it. Troll spin. Yep, he returned the favor. <laughs> I'm done. <laughs> he returned the favor. He said, I can do it as well and two stock you, bro. <laughs> if you had to pick one fast food place to eat your whole life, which one you pick in? That's such a good question. Um, Maybe McDonald's. I feel like they change up their menu quite a lot. So I feel like... I can survive with that. I was gonna say KFC, but their menu is kind of too limited for that, bro. What about you, Boroshiki? Man, I find this iPhone XR phone too long. It went down 20% within an hour. Yeah, that battery health is gone. But you can get a new battery queue if you if you want it to have a normal battery. Just get like a buy a new battery, and it will go back to normal. Or get a new iPhone. Now I leave my iPad to charge overnight. I only got it at the start of the year. That yeah, that you shouldn't do that. You shouldn't do that. Like what's killing off your battery is leaving it to charge overnight. Cause once it hits a hundred percent, you're still putting power into it, and that kills off the um battery health. Think of it like armor break, bro. You're just giving your battery armor break every time you charge it overnight, fam. You professional commentator. Hey, appreciate you, bro. Let's go. Two stock back to back for real for real. Yo, Kuroko, what's up man? How you doing bro? Good to see you in the stream. KFC is expensive as fuck. Is it? I wouldn't say so. What are you getting at KFC bro? Don't wait until 5% to charge it that kills it too. Say swear, why? I didn't know that. He's getting killed at KFC at the airport. Yeah, no, I'm legit, bro. Geza needs to find a hyperbolic time shape that Freezer used. I'm done. But yeah, no, Itachi's just adapting back, bro. But it looks like Geza did what you just said in between the match, bro. Look at that Sasuke mash, man. Damn. Rikido using his awakening earlier. Dark with the top tier advice, keep it between 20 and 80%. I'm going to try to do that from now on. I thought that letting it die then charging it to 100% was good. Nah, don't let it die. Letting it die is not good either.
I wouldn't say letting it die because it will turn. It will when you let it die, it will automatically turn on at five percent. So that's why you shouldn't let it die. Again, keep it around twenty and that. Nice ultimate juice to get out of the guard break setup. That was beautiful. That chakra dash cancel was literally perfect. I thought he was gonna call Nagato for sure. Damn, can't counter Jutsu's man. Nice counter. Nice dodge. Ukido Itachi just playing patient, finds the combo. Nice counter uh, bait there. Yep, Nagato Mash just shut that one right down. These men, Haki's optimal enough for all the. Touch you slowly making the clutch, man. Oh, Garamash can't defeat it with a double jump. Oh, Sasuke combo missing near a wall. It often does that, doesn't go for the counter punish. Nice patience there by Rikido Itachi. Juggle opportunity here for Geza. Ugh. Their counter read, awakening opportunity here for Rikido Itachi. That yo, the counter reads are on point with Rikido Itachi. Ooh! No, got caught on landing frames. He should have double jumped, bro. That man should have double jumped or jump switch. Man got caught on landing frames. That's crazy. Should have jumped, double jumped, or jump switched in the air, then he wouldn't have got caught. Looks like Geza watched your Renny Sasuke showcase. Let's go. Let's go. Come on, man. He's been using he's been using that ultimate jutsu iframes to get out of stuff. And he caught him on landing frames? And he's he's been getting the snipes, Levi. You love it, man. I think that's an aspect of editing that is often overlooked. It's often about the endurance playing for two hours straight at top level. Now, facts. 100% agree with you. 100% agree with you, AZ. It's not easy, especially in tournaments as well. When tournaments can go on to like five or eight hours, it's not easy, bro. That man got caught on landing frames. In tournaments, you at least have a sort of break in between matches. True. A A is soon to be match point, guys.
Wait, let me do a poll, fam. Let me do a poll right now. Nice counter. Damn, you guys really like that E Team versus Rikido Touchy video. Say no more. Noted. You guys really like that one. Damn, that sure can really shut down Sasuke's invincibility frames. That's crazy. much damn we could have touched he closes it out with an ultimate jutsu man E a bit late with the poll this time. I think it's actually good I was late to the poll since the match was so close. So it'll be more interesting to see who people vote for. She's about to make a match point for himself. Yo, E soon. I'll show in PM Twitter for the trap star hoodie. You'll send me something for the trap star. Yeah, let me know, um, bro. Just hit me up when you, whenever you're ready, man. Hey, Edward Emmanuel Bentley is actually a hard name, I'm not going to lie to you. Rikido Tachi about to get the two star? Oh, try to get the tag convert. Nice counter parry. Nurture Airlines, we're going for one flight. Nice counter parry, nice counter to counter. Wait, what's that? What the heck is that? Drake's, yeah, Drake's, what is that? I don't even know what that is. Yo, so many counters, bro. And it's a two stock, bro. Match point to Rikido Itachi, man. 9 8. Yeah, no, I have no idea what that is, man.
I'm not even acting, I genuinely don't know what that is. Look it up, Ian? Nah, I'm not gonna look it up, that sounds suspicious, bro. <laughs> Blaker said, what Keith said, I hear that though. Match point to Rikuro Itachi here. Is this the third first to ten he's gonna witch? He's gonna win in a row against Geza. Or will Geza make his revenge? Let's see man. Nice counter yo, the counter yeah. Geza, Geza is now counter panicking. Instead of using his fundamentals for defense, close range he's counter panicking. Rikuro Itachi has got the reads on the counter. He's utilizing safe aggression and he's constantly punishing him for every counter he makes, bro. Look at the patience. Not sure why he chakra dash there, but hey. Nice. Kunai ninja move dodge into strike back convert. Oh, bro, he dropped it again. He, he's dropping combos at weird times, but then picking them back up. Sub. Sub again? No, you can't sub. Push him, push that man. Ah, oh, got caught by Mash. Extension. We tried to go for the sub bait. Got the guard break though. Nice. Bro, how did he dash through the sand though? I, I'm assuming he dashed through the gap. Nice switch dodge by Geza. Awakening opportunity here goes for the Nagato Mash. Nice guard bounce pressure. Guard manipulation doesn't get it. Nice. Patience. Dashing through the sand gaps, but he got button locked. That's the bad thing about Gara. Even if you're you've got the reactions and got the knowledge to dash through his gaps, you will get button locked after you dash through it. Getting punished for, for, for reading your opponent correctly, bro. Getting punished for execution, man. You hate to see it, bro. Hasharam is the same though. If you tilt how of his IC2, you get a button locked for a bit. Getting punished for playing good, man. Hey, Shek Mod Gang, welcome to the stream, my guy. Came in with the compliment, W Streamer E. Appreciate it, man. Ugh, the ultimate juicy cancel. Geza manages to call the match back and end the round with a victory. Yo, Ken, what's good, man? How you doing? <laughs> that hero vs villain stream was lit. Oh, you mean Hero vs Dark Mask? Yeah. That was the NA tournament, bro. I think B tier characters and low low A tier characters would be good. The ones that we don't normally see. Yo, Geza gonna return the two stock? Geza gonna return the two stock? They are A tier characters, but slightly worse. Nah. Like, Mifune is definitely a lot worse than Last Naruto. And Last Naruto is an A tier. I've been lurking in here since like six matches and the gameplay is sweet. Hey, appreciate it, man. But how come you lurking, bro? That's not like you. <laughs> Guess I'm about to return this two stock to Riko Utachi. He said, match point where, bro? Match point where? Match point where? Trying to tilt out of my awakening combos. How dare you, sir? Bro, yeah. Sasuke's in. Sasuke Susano misses close range, just like Shisui's Jutsu. There's like a gap. Small gap that you can take advantage of. Boom. Okay, no two stock here.
Yeah, Ken, yeah, he definitely does that. Plato does that too as well. That's interesting. You got 10 on Geza? Say no more, I'm gonna need you to run me that money if Geza loses. Match point for both players. Next one to lose loses. He said, "I got you, Monk." No, no, I was playing Monk. Don't worry about it. They have to F ten again. That one was too close. I wouldn't say they have to F ten again because they've already played twice. This is their third one. Currently, we could have touched. He's winning with two wins. And Geza hasn't won a F10 versus Rikido Tachi yet. This could be a first for Geza. He said, he said Geza please win. Yo, a lot of people, 74. No, 57% of you think Geza won't win and 43% think um, he will. 105 votes. Final match. Let's go. Oh, nice guard bounce pressure. Maintaining the neutral. Switch Jutsu aggression. Still maintaining it. Preemptive counter there by Geza. Can't be caught panic countering this match, bro. He needs to utilize that fundamental defense and not get punished for his counters. Nagato Mesh misses. Nice uh, movement there by Geza. Switch Jutsu's at it again. Kunai Ninja movement dashes right into the last Naruto Jutsu, unlike Rikido Itachi. Nice confirmed there by Geza. Last Naruto Mesh gonna reduce that health lead. Look at the look at the Kunai Ninja movement. Ugh, that instant guard break tech by Geza was nice bro, some of that Yama tech. Look at the healthy health lead that he's got. Look at the healthy health lead, Geza might actually have this bro. Oh, Reed Roshi was like, you know what, awakening. Let's go. Yeah, we could have touch he's just closing that gap. Why does he finish the neutral combo though? Yeah, why does he why why does he finish the neutral combo? I don't really get it. We could have touch he really deleted Gezza's um health lead, bro, and he converted into a ground combo because he de-awakened. I'm done. But yeah, he really deleted his health lead. Bro, got caught on landing frames, unlucky. He really deleted his health lead <laughs> with um unlucky got caught on landing frames as well. But he um what I've been trying to say, he really deleted oh he really deleted that health lead with his awakening. But Geza still has his. You know he's gonna save it for the last round. Nice movement here by Rikido Itachi. He's gotta close that out now. He just got his awakening off. He's gotta close it. Gets it out on this round, otherwise I don't think he has a chance to win this. Nice counter. Nice. Geza won't awaken though. It would be a waste for him to awaken. 
since both players are limited to one awakening per match. Rikido Itachi manages to close it out. MK always comes in late and asks what the score is, I swear. I've never seen this man early to a first attempt. Will Gether redeem himself or will touch his reign carry on? Find out on the next episode of Naruto Storm 4. Omar, we like that one, man. Gether winning is better for the rivalry, but I got my money on Itachi. I agree with you, bro. The prophecy says Itachi wins. Gezer doesn't have pain Nagato or Hashi, but he has a story. Yeah, it'll be harder to win with Awakening, but he can get easy max damage with Rene Sasuke's Awakening as long as he gets a confirm. Yeah, Rukio is going to play keep out now, get that chakra back up, switch to avoid the Gara Jutsu, one of the, the most optimal ways to avoid that Jutsu. Bro, nice keep up with the pressure Gezer. Ooh, the grab finish! Yeah, um, Rukio Itachi's movement is too stale, bro. He just keeps jumping in place which gives Geza the opportunity to set him up for guard manipulation or grab. His movement needs to be more dynamic when he's getting pressured, he needs to stop jumping in the same place. It's unusual for him, for his movement to be so static. He's using too much stationary defense. He needs to start using that dynamic defense bro. Bro, he didn't get counted there? And how did Geza win that mash battle? Oh, I'm done. So Rikido Tachi needs to push him here. He's got a chakra advantage. Nice. He should have mashed him there, I'm not gonna lie. He has Nagato. Nagato just wins mash battles when you dash him off on guard. He still needs to push him though. He shouldn't air dash Geza it never works out for you. He needs to pick carefully where he's going to sub here. I'm surprised he didn't wait to pull Nagato. Oh, Geza might have this, bro. Rikido Itachi can't afford to make any mistakes here. Otherwise, it's going to be over for him. Okay, Madara Jutsu worked out. Oh, you're lucky. He didn't get strike back off that Itachi. You're so lucky. Your, your, your set would have been done. Your set would have been done. I think Geza's retreating because he knows he has the health lead. Plus, if he retreats, he'll get the Welfare Chakra and it will put him in a better position to awaken. Looking for the counter. On. Yo, Geza responds. Geza switched at one point and then mashed him out. Troll spin as well. If he troll spins and loses, it's a long day. Nope. Looks like he's got this. It's done. Sand burial finish, bro. Geza wins it man! Congratulations! The hyperbolic time chamber training paid off man, let's go. Let's go. Beautiful adaptation showcased by Geza there. You got 192 viewers, damn you guys shut up. While you're here, don't forget to like the stream. Hope you guys enjoyed that first attempt. That was one of the most enjoyable first attempts I've um, watched actually. It was up there with uh, Rikido Tachi vs Playco for sure. If you want to check out the first attempt after the stream and you missed the beginning, I'll plug the playlist here. Yeah man, let, let's go for first to 20. No way. I need to eat. There's no way that's happening. Sorry. I'm out of here. <laughs> let, me plug, let me plug my playlist and go fam. Oh my days. Yeah, it actually did seem a bit stiff there. Yeah, he was using too much stationary defense. He's no his defense is normally more dynamic than that. So I'm not sure what happened exactly. Cause even if his main characters are banned, that shouldn't nerf his defense. If 
first to 51 day truly impossible I will not be here for that but yeah check out the playlist man we got tips and tricks if you want to learn how to air counter you can do that if you want character guides learn how to play different characters in the game whilst Naruto you can do that um, if you want to know my character tier list you can do that as well I'll be waking I'll be making an updated one soon see ya OZ appreciate it if you touch you can't use this top beam it can't be a full power I agree thanks for the stream EB no problem bro no problem MP but yeah, Rikido Itachi was technically enough since it was rules, but it was still a wonderful set played by Geza. His comebacks on a lot of the matches were, were so good, bro. So I think their first to 10 score, or first to 10 set score, is 2-1. Rikido Itachi has beaten Geza twice in no rules, and Geza has beaten him once in rules. What are you going to eat? No idea, bro. Shiki, have you got any recommendations? I was thinking garlic bread and wings. Gonna go make some real quick wrapped in maple syrup. It's amazing. We could have thought she could have lost easy against Shan if there was rules. Uh, it's debatable. Debatable. Since when does Geza does rules? I only see him if there's no rules. He does rules if it's Rikido versus against Rikido Itachi. But if you want the full contest on that MK, check out their previous first to tens. The playlist is there. Garlic bread and wings, definitely the move. The only thing that's long is that I have to go do the garlic bread, and that takes like 10 minutes. I can't be bothered for that. He could have lost against Shannon Rules because of the connection. I don't know if Geza. I don't know if Rikido Tachi knows how to play in rules. Um. Sorry, in a uh, tuba. I'm not sure how well he plays in it. I know Shan can definitely do it. If you want to join the Discord and stay up to date when these events happen, feel free. And you know, follow me on Twitter. I need to get my followers up, followers up so I can get those review codes, man. Follow me on Twitter, man. Follow me on Twitter. I'm gonna pin my tweet. Well, I'm not gonna pin my tweet. I'm gonna put it in the chat. Follow, but follow me on Twitter, man. Didn't Riku do Itachi win against Shando? But yeah, if you guys want any tutorials, any live ones, let me know. Otherwise, the man's gonna go eat real quick. I'm not gonna lie to you. But well played to both players, man. GG's indeed, man. GG's indeed. I didn't see the point of those rules if guys are just gonna run with counter every match. I mean he didn't run with counter every match but when he was feeling the pressure he definitely switched to a more defensive playstyle.
Let me know when Geza pleats break and then I'll start considering him. That was the highlight of the set. The the highlight factor. Uh, uh what part uh Plaker? Syrup on wings, yeah. Basically, you cook them in it, and then you get a bowl, and then you can put the maple syrup in the bowl, and then you wrap the wings in the maple syrup, so you get that like contrast of like chicken with a bit of spice with a bit of sweetness, bro. You can do that with honey wrapped wings as well. It actually was going in Gezzer's face and having to bait counter too much. Yeah, it's true. Unfortunately in this game there's not at the highest level of play there's not much counters to um counters especially when you got the read because the switch combo can still get countered E cooking video when hey it's soon come back I'll show you I'll show you I'll show you my cooking tricks man I'm just trying to get in one like one match real quick but hey no one, no one's, no one's online. Ooh, uh, Playco, can you plug your tournament again? I'll probably end up making a video tournament, but plug it in the chat and then I can pin it. Because we're trying to get as much people to go to it as possible. Beautiful stuff. When should you do a counter parry over a regular counter? Well, you want to do a counter parry when you want to punish your opponent. So let's say you have no subs. That's the best time to do a counter. So let's say your opponent has four subs here yeah, and you have no subs. It's, it would in that situation it would be best to do a counter over a counter parry because you want to reset the neutral so you get time to charge your chakra and for your subs to come back and then when you reset the neutral you can go into switch jutsu defense especially with lost naruto so you can buy even more time to for your subs to come back you would go for a counter parry if like let's say your opponent had no subs and you had full subs you want to go into a counter parry so you can get a direct damage punish so you can convert straight into a combo and go for a max damage punish whether that's switch combo into ultimate jutsu switch combo into attack up pill um ic1 into jump tag into switch combo into attack up pill for max damage so those are the different situations where you would choose whether to counter or to counter parry It's fine since this got turned into a last minute thing. I feel you. You just like me, I look for blue bar, li bro, literally. You will not see me you will not see me go for yellow bars, man. Looks like we're gonna have another top eight. Hey, let's go. Michael said and noted. Let's go. Making them notes. We love to see it, man. I just want to play the E-team for the one time, man. That's all, man. Bruh. Ranked match. Why you do me like this, man? Don't kick me, please. Hey, he didn't kick me. Let's go. All right, we're going to play the E team for the one time on the PS5, and then we cut in.
Oh, that perfect chakra dash cancel. They call me Rikido Itachi. <laughs> oh, that switch dodge, they call me Gether. Ooh, that switch dodge in the air, I'm sick of the game. You can't question me, I'm sick. Bro, it missed. Oh, sad face. Oh, the Sasuke combo really just missed for no reason. That's crazy. Mifune, you suck. That dodge? Oh, you thought I was gonna sub. No, I did it too late. But that actually combos. I did it too late though. The switch juicy defense is too good. Oh, it's too good! We done here. We done here. But yeah, I hope you enjoyed that quick match. Hey, Uchiha Wolf Gaming with a one dollar donation. Appreciate you, bro. Thank you, man. Been watching your channel for a while. A hey, long time supporter. We love to see it, man. What videos you've been watching, fam? What PlayStation did I buy for Storm 4 PS5? Get a PS5. Get a PS5, sir. Do you not get the PS4? Get a PS5. Less lag, more more stable game, faster load times, better graphics. E, thanks for hosting the first attendance and tournaments. Have a good one. No problem team, I'll see you later man, I need the Sugetsu guide soon to come actually. But yeah man, with that, I'm gonna head out, I'll see you guys next time. Peace out and enjoy the rest of your day slash night, depending on what the time is. See ya!